Hello children. Uh, welcome to Children's Time today. I'm Pastor Krista and uh, today's parable I would like to explain is called the parable of the mustard seed. Now as we recall um, Jesus used stories to tell, to teach his disciples things. So he used this special kind of story called a parable. And uh, he did that so that he could explain to the people following what he was talking about in, in ways that they would understand. Um, for us, since we're born at a different time, since we're not um, in that place, in that time, it might be a little bit difficult for us for us to understand. So that's why I'm explaining. Okay, the par parable of the mustard seed. It's in Matthew 13 uh, verses 31 and 32. It says this, Jesus told them another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like this. A man takes a mustard seed and sowed it, sows it in his field. It is the smallest of all the seeds, but when it grows up, it is the biggest of all plants. It becomes a tree so that birds come and make their nests in its branches. Okay, now stop right there because I have to make a little trip to the kitchen. Now, if you are like me, you have this kind of mustard. Is this a seed? No, this is mustard. And um, we don't know, but mustard comes from seeds. It comes from a plant. Mustard starts out as a little tiny, 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 teeny, teeny seed. And you plant it in the ground and it grows into a big plant. And then the plant, um, it has seeds that fall off and you collect those, you dry those seeds, you pound them down till it becomes a powder. Then you mix it with liquids. Let's see what this one's mixed with. Vinegar, water, salt, turmeric, paprika, and spices, and it becomes mustard that we know. But those mustard seeds that start out are so small. They're teeny, teeny, tiny, tiny, teeny seeds and they grow into this big plant. And so it's almost like weeds. This is my house, the outside of my house. And if you look at my lawn, isn't it beautiful and green? It's so lovely. The grass is so pretty. What I wanna do is I'll show you that in my grass, see those little plants? So the straight, straight um, blades of grass, and then there's little plants, there's little leaves, little, sometimes there's little flowers. Those are what we call weeds. There's little weeds hanging inside next to the grass. So what Jesus is trying to say is that weeds grow into big plants. If you leave them alone, the weeds will take over. And Jesus is trying to say that that's what um, a mustard seed, the mustard seed is like that. And that's what the kingdom of heaven is like. Now the kingdom of heaven is an amazing, amazing, dreamy place that um, that we create here on earth so that we make everyone feel good, we treat everyone nicely, everyone is happy and joyful and has what they need, has enough food, has enough uh, shelter, has, uh, has the good clothing so that they can be protected. Um, has good doctors and nurses and education and teachers so that we can all be uh, in the best shape we can be. That's the kingdom of heaven. And so Jesus is trying to say that if we um, talk about and help build up 
the kingdom of heaven, it will grow like a weed and take over. And so that's what we're trying to do with, um, with our, how we behave, how we live, what we say to each other, how we treat each other. We're trying to grow the kingdom of heaven like a mustard plant where birds can come and perch in our branches. So thank you. This ends the parable of the mustard seed and I will see you next week.